Hi, I'm Dr. Thomas Armstrong, and today we're talking about Dr. Howard Gardner's theory of multiple intelligences. And in a previous video, I was talking about how the different intelligences in Gardner's model have different patterns of moving throughout the lifespan. Music seems to develop earlier and stays strong into old age. Logic smart peaks pretty early in young adulthood. Uh, cell smart and people smart get gradually better as we acquire life experience through our lives. And you might wonder, well, what kind of use can I make of this? Well, it can be very helpful to us in thinking about what field we want to pursue, especially if we're in middle age. If we're in middle age and you perhaps want to go ahead and try to uh, discover a new mathematical idea or new scientific law or whatever, it may be too late for you because most of the great mathematical and scientific discoveries have been made by people under the age of 40. On the other hand, if you want to really write the great you know, next wonderful novel or play or short story, it's really possible to late bloom in word smart. In fact, one great example is Toni Morrison, uh, the American writer who didn't even start her first novel or publish it until the age of uh, 39, the bluest eye. And in her 60s, she was awarded the Nobel Prize in Literature. So that's a very good field to go into if you're in your 50s or 60s and you want to start uh, your life as a writer. Uh, at the same time, uh, let's say you want to take on leadership roles and you haven't done much with that uh, in the previous 40 or 50 years, that's okay because we develop our self-smart, our ability to know ourselves and our people smart to interact as we get older. And oftentimes the leadership roles in communities and in countries and cultures are given over to the elders of society. So this can give you a sense of which fields it may be practical to begin with uh, even if you're later on in your life. You can late bloom in different fields. For more information about the theory of multiple intelligences, see my books, Seven Kinds of Smart, Identifying and Developing Your Multiple Intelligences, that's for adult learners and high school and college students. My book, Multiple Intelligences in the Classroom, this is for the K-12 teacher, and in their own way, discovering and encouraging your child's multiple intelligences. And this is designed specifically for parents. Thank you.